Dateline, Secret Island, where a familiar lab guy works on a mysterious project. Careful. This specimen is very fragile. Dinner time. Oh, run me alive! Oh, come on. I'm sure it's just a little scratch. Okay. A big scratch. Action League, now. Today's episode, Your Plastic Fuck. We find our heroes at Action HQ, getting the lowdown from the big boss man. Something's gone amok on Secret Island, and the Navy's gonna blow the whole place to smithereens in four minutes. Good show! Time for some fireworks! Yeah! Cool! I call the binoculars! You dug it! Build on that island! Whoa, he's gonna have a great view! You're gonna have a great view of the emergency room if you don't get over there and save him! Now get on it! Jack got it! Roger that! Okie dokie! Moments later at Secret Island, our heroes begin the search for the elusive pointy-headed lab geek. Bill! Come out, come out, wherever you are! I hear something. Bill, is that you? Not unless he's gained a lot of weight. Something tells me we just found Bill's project. They're amazing. They're incredible. They're toast. Bonsai. Please do not feed or maim the dinosaurs when visiting your plastic park. Thank you. How about I maim you instead? Bill, what's going on here? The culmination of my life's work. From a single shred of plastic, I clone these magnificent creatures, all with the single intent of furthering humanity's knowledge. And of course, selling these handsome coffee mugs. Who wants a set? I'll take two. Better wrap them to go. The Navy's blowing up the whole place because your beasties are out of control. That's nonsense. I've cloned only docile vegetarians. Yeah. Uh, except for that one. Yeah. No. I was afraid of this. It's gotten a taste for flesh. Head for the chopper! Head away from the chopper! We're trapped! Blimey! Is the League about to become a buffet for a B-movie behemoth? Uh, that's what I was gonna say. Stay tuned for the action nod conclusion of Action League Now. Hey, Kablamo! Action League Now. Dino, Wacko. Hero, Snacko. Can the League escape a similar fate? Yeah! No way, Jacko. Let me get a lantern. Flesh! Blimey! We're all still alive! Yay! But in about ten seconds, the Navy's gonna blow up the island! <laughs> Meanwhile... Prepare to commence bombing! You can't, Admiral! The Action League's still over there! I've got my orders, Chief. Oh well, I tried. At least I'm gonna die with me flippers on. Wait, that's it. Stinky, take off your flippers. No way! Get him! Take him off! That's him! Bosses! Ooh! Gross! Smell! Stinkers! Yeah! Three, two, two! Bad! Oh, it's you. Commence bombing! Wait, you can't. Not just for me, but for the love of science, the love of knowledge, the love of... sequels! Sequels? Cancel that order, Gunner! We've got our franchise to protect. Yay! Not nearly the end. Dateline, the moonlit waters of Big Kitchen Lake, where the chief tries out a dateline of his own. Come here, baby, and give me a smoochie. But Snookums, shouldn't we be getting back to shore? Don't worry, sweet little pudding pop. We're in the love boat. Well, I'm getting love boat sick. It's <laughs> just a little free. Here, let me comfort you. Whoa! 
And the unnatural cause of this natural disaster? Haha! <laughs> With my new wind machine, I'm gonna blow the Action League away! Literally! Action League, now! Today's episode, Winds of Evil. We find our heroes at Action HQ discussing a matter of vital importance. Sorry we missed your party last night, Stinky. Yeah, I hope you didn't go to a lot of trouble. Oh no, not at all. Huh, guess everyone's a bit late. We wanted to come, but, uh... uh... I had to wash my hair. Uh, I had to wash my socks. I thought we didn't go because this house is a toilet and smells like you know what. Heh, <laughs> would you look at the time? So me flat smells like you know what, eh? Just for that, I'm never inviting any of yous into my home again. Fine. Good. What a relief. <sighs> Chief, what happened to you? I got my fanny waxed by another freak windstorm. If we don't do something, millions could die. Left eye analysis. There's nothing we can do. Oh, well. Guess that's it for today. All right. Bombo. Half day. See ya. Later that night. Hey, roomies, where you going? Mandy Patinkin's on Leno. Ah! Looks like one action moron just found out which way the wind is blowing. <laughs> Don't worry, Melty. You'll be safe here. You're a real pal, Flesh. Nighty night. It's like the storm's following us wherever we go. My house blowed away. Relax. This house was built to last. Until today! Ah! It's a miracle. We're OK. Ah! With nowhere else to turn, our houseless heroes arrive at number two, Lavatory Lane. Stinky! Help! Let us in. What do you want? The hurricane destroyed all of our houses. Let us in. But I thought my home smelled like you know what. It does, but we're desperate. You had your chance. Oh, no. It's starting again. Hey, action lunkheads. Say hello to your biggest fan. The, the mayor. mayor. You were expecting Al Roker? But enough about me. Will the League be blown to bits? Will Stinky stay selfishly sealed? Find out in the action huffed conclusion of Action League Now. Action League Now. The League blown away. Stinky's throne still okay. As time runs out, have the League's chances for survival gone down the tubes? you promise to come stay for a weekend at me beach house? Yes! yes. Okie dokie! Hurry! Welcome to Shea Stinky! Yeah. Yeah. Fools! Your dumper's no damper to me! Okay! No more Mr. Nice Mayor. Your John is gone. Full power. Uh-oh. Here's trouble. Ooh, ow, 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 ow. All clear. We made it. Thanks, Stinky. No problem. You blokes are gonna love me, Beach House. That weekend. The smell! Can't breathe! Air, please. Hey, what are you guys doing up here? We're serving dinner downstairs. Help! The end. Dateline, Kitty Pool Harbor, where an international smuggling ring is blown out of the water by our action blowhards. Freeze, your rotters! 
You're busted! Swing that contraband over this way, pronto! No problem. The coast is clear, Mr. Mayor. Good work, yeoman. Now let me inspect my precious treasure. Aye, aye, sir, Mayor, sir. Hello, my pretties. With you two as breeding stock, I'll corner the Easter chick market in no time. I'll be richer than Bill Cosby. <laughs> Action lead now. Today's episode, Chicky Chicky Bang Bang. With a sleazy smuggling ring on the loose, the league starts asking tough questions. Who wants some hoagie? I do. Let's eat! I'm starving! Yummies! Wait, stop the picnic. I just found out what those smugglers were, um, smuggling. A rare species of Easter chick. That's horrible, Bill. But we've got a hoagie to eat. Yay! You don't understand. These birds multiply at an alarming rate and have been known to eat anything. Is that bad? Meanwhile, at the mayoral mansion... Look at them all. I'll be able to pay off my student loans. They finished off all ten bags of bird seed, Mr. Mayor. Well, that should hold them for a while. Now come give me a hand with my Easter Chick website. I'm warning you, if we don't stop these chicks now, we'll have an ecological disaster on our hands. Ecological sneakological! Which part of we've got a hoagie to eat, didn't you understand? Yay! Blimey! What's that? Not good. There goes lunch. Oh no, I was afraid of this. They're breeding out of control. And they're headed for the World Food Reserve. Blast it, Bill! Why can you warn us? Now let's move out! Moments later... Crikey! We're too late! I was afraid of this, too. Now that the World Food Reserve is gone, who knows what they'll eat next. Hello, friends. The mayor! Can I interest you in some cuddly Easter chicks? Ow! I mean, oh wow, they sure are cute and attractively priced. Act now! Yay! The mayor's toast! Oh, so are we! What's this? Is the Action League about to become Action Feed? Find out in the Action Tech conclusion of Action League Now. Hello again. Action League Now. Here a chick, there a chick, everywhere a chick chick. Is it lunchtime for our heroes? All right, everybody back up slowly. No sudden moves or loud sounds. Meow! Quiet, you melted moron! Wait, do that again. I can't. Sure you can. Meow! Cut it out! Amazing. That sound is remarkably similar to their mating call. I have an idea. Yow! Keep hitting it! That's an order! No more! Please! Sorry, Melty. Yow! Hey, give me a crack! It's my turn! Yow! Moments later... Good work, Meltman! You're wanting let those chicks straight to the boat. Now they can go back to their natural habitat. You know, aside from all that pecking to death, they sure were cute. That's why I kept one. I mean, two, four, eight, eleventy-five, nine. Ah! No! Help. Get them back! You bozo! The end. Dateline Action League Testing Center. To renew their action hero licenses, our heroes face an excruciating, exhausting exam. The first grade equivalency test. Time's up. Hand in your answer sheets. Moments later... Thunder Girl, pass. Chief, pass. Stinky Diver, pass. Meltman, pass. Justice, pass. I guess that's it. No, wait. The flesh fell. Hooray for me! Sorry, flesh, but I have no choice but to ask you for your badge. Why? Did you lose yours? 
Now, you bonehead! Don't you get it? You're out of the Action League! Huh? Well... <laughs> Action League, now. Today's episode, The Naked and the Dumb. We find our heroes at Action Headquarters trying to solve the mystery behind Flesh's failure. Blimey! The moron marked his answers in the shape of a cat! I did not! I knew he couldn't be that stupid. I made a little kitten. Oi. I'm sorry, Flesh. I don't like it any more than you do, but rules are rules. You'll have to leave now, big fella. Oh, jeez. Wait, Chief. We need the flesh. None of us has super strength. Oh, yeah? Watch and be amazed. <laughs> uh, are you amazed yet? Bill, there must be some way the flesh can stay in the league. There's nothing I can do. Unless, of course, he retakes the test and passes it. And there is nothing you can do. Wait, we can help him study. Let's do it. Good idea. And so the Action League tutors a disrobed dingbat. Two, three, four birdies. Now how many birdies are left if you take away one? Let's see. Ow! Eleven-D-five? Close enough. I think our work here is done. Now you draw a triangle, Flesh. Funsies! Now, let's see. Should I put the ruler here? Ow! Oh, just anywhere's fine. See? Stinky. Now write your name. Okie dokie. Or... Oh! 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 After a week of intensive care, er, study, the League finally gives the Flesh what he needs to pass his exam. Woo! I'm all over this test. Looks like the test is all over you, Cheat Notes Flesh. Blast it, Bill! It's the Big Dope's only chance of passing! Sorry. League regulations. No Cheat Notes. But I used them. Uh, didn't. Don't worry. You guys learned me real good. Ah! Begin. Will the Flesh best the test and make the grade? First grade? Or was all his schooling for squat? Find out in the action tutored conclusion of Action League. Action League. Now, the flesh a flunk out. The League flung about. Will the naked one pass? There's doubt. Eggs are done. A lot of doubt. But as they await the results, the loyal League never loses hope. I get dibs on his desk. I get his parking place. I get his thigh master. Unbelievable. In all my years of science. What is it, Bill? He got every answer right. All right! All right. There you go. Come on. So, Flesh, I guess we did teach you something. You sure did. The kitten I drawled was bad. So this time, I made a little doggy. Rup, rup. The <laughs> end. Eight line. Bill the Lab Guy's Lab, where a stoked scientist makes an astonishing announcement. This is one of the most important discoveries in medical history. I thought somebody already invented the guinea pig. Not that, Flesh. This guinea pig carries a previously unidentified virus I've just christened the body-eating virus because, well, it eats your body until there's nothing left. Cool. Yes, and highly contagious. Whatever you do, don't touch that animal. Look, guys, I'm a cowboy. Yeehaw! Oopsies. Action League, now. Today's episode, What's Eating the Flesh? As a body-eating virus violates the flesh, the League turns to a trusted lab guy for help. Hmm, fascinating. There's nothing I can do, and if anyone touches him, they're doomed as well. Bill, you've got to cure him! Flesh's life is at stake! Yeah, right, but more important, who else is gonna caddy for me at the All Cheese Golf Classic? Well, I could look for a cure in the rainforest. I know a shaman who might be able to help. Well, go find a blasted shaman then! 
I tee off at 1.30, and I can't win without the flesh! Don't worry, flesh. You're gonna be fine. Phew, that's a relief. And so, as a lab guy races the clock to find a cure, the League gives the flesh a little TLC. Ugh, repulsive. Talk about beyond the call of duty. Hey, at least you don't have to shave his chest. Meanwhile, at Waxed Wood Driving Range, the Chief attends to more pressing matters. I am Tiger Woods! I did it! I shaved his chest without touching him! <laughs> no! Now I've got the body-eating virus! Yuck! I'm out of here! <laughs> Thunder girl, fleeing the virus before it infects. Oh! Ah! Oh! Crikey! Now we've all got it. My arm. No, that's mine. Will someone pass me a leg? Meanwhile, at Kitchen Windowsill Rainforest, Bill consults with a colleague. The cure for the body-eating virus. What is it? Booga booga. Medicinal sap. Excellent. Where is this sap? Ooga booga booga. Bowie! Shanked it again! No, I was afraid of this. Where is the sap? Ooga. Yes, yes. Tell me, Ooga what? Ow. Blast it! That was my last ball! Chief, we need help. Fast! Okay, but just don't touch me! Hey, gang, wait up! You morons! Now we're all doomed! Will the Action League rest in pieces? Find out in the action munched conclusion of Action League Now. Hey, Kablamaholics! Action League Now. The League infected, their heads ejected. As the body-eating virus consumes our heroes, Bill the Lab Guy awakens to some good news. Ha. Huh. The sap. The medicinal sap. Eureka. Meanwhile, the League bands together for a touching final farewell. Blast it! If I had any legs left, I'd stomp all your fool heads into the ground! Huh? What the? Relax, Chief. It's the cure. All right, the Bill! Yay! Bill rules! You the man! And there's still time to make my golf tournament! Now, if I only had a golf ball left. Hey! Wait a minute! Moments later... Here we go! Give it a ride, Chief! Oop! Oh! Ahead and one! You see, Bill? I told you I couldn't win without the flesh! <laughs> the end. Dateline, Bill the Lab Guy's lab, where a brilliant brainiac applies his decades of scientific study to the lube job. Hurry it up, Lab Guy! Hodgepodge is on the loose again, and we need the action mobile ASAP! Got it? I got it all right, and you're gonna get yours, action jerks! Hodgepodge, you fiend. What have you done to the action mobile? Just watch, half a lab guy! Now the action mobile's gonna be unsafe at any speed! Ah! Uh. Action League, now. Today's episode, Tune Up of Terror. We find our heroes at Action HQ, all revved up and ready to go. Okay, you bozos. Hodgepodge is out there like a bad smell on our booyah base. Now get on it! Great, I'll drive. What? Good one. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> and I'm the king of Finland. I'm serious. I finally passed my driver's test. I guess they got tired of him coming down there and wrecking all their cars. What do you say, Chief? Can I drive, can I? Oh, pretty, please. All right, just this once. Yay, I get to drive! Now that's torque. Now 
Go easy on that gas pedal. <laughs> ah! What was that, Chief? I said go easy on that. Ah! Oh. How's my driving? Now one eight hundred jerks. Look out! Out the way! Easy. supposed to have airbags? <laughs> Ow! Moments later... Looks like you won't be needing this anymore, sure. Menace, Roadhog! But, Chief, it's not my fault. That car's got a mind of its own. Well, that makes one of you. From now on, the only thing you're driving is a gas. The rest of you, let's move out! But... but... <laughs> oh man. No, I was afraid of this. Phil! What happened to your legs? It's hodgepodge. He's planted a remote control device in the Axmobile. That car's a death trap. Phew, glad I'm not with him. No, you fool. We have to stop them. Uh, yeah, right. This is my big chance to be a hero and prove I can drive. Oh, joy. Uh, Ow. Sorry, I'm not used to power brakes. Meanwhile... Keep your eyes peeled for hodgepodge. What a beautiful day for a little spin action, dumbheads! Here comes lunch! Yummers! Ugh. Yuckers! Chief, did you take a driving lesson from Meltman? That melted meathead wrecked a delicate calibration of the rack and pinion steering! Fortunately, I'm a great driver, and I can adjust! Ah! Nice adjustment, Chief! Blast it! What in the Sam Hill is going on here? Chief, no! Stop the car! Oh, goody, goody, gumdrop! Bumper cars for bumper jerks! Whoa! Don't worry, Chief. Uh, start worrying. Ah! Put on the brakes! Mommy! Hey, stop! Not having fun! Going my way, action losers! Hot oh, That's my name! A chance to wear it out! <laughs> What's this? Is the Action League about to become an action pancake? Find out in the action injection fueled conclusion of Action League Now. Action League Now. With a vengeful villain enjoying his joystick, is this the end of the road for our speeding superheroes? Sorry, I don't break for evil. Huh? Ah! Steer again! Why don't these things work on big cars? Darn! Ah! Later that day. Yay! No, fans, we owe you our lives. If you ever want to drive the action mobile. Do you mean it? You've earned it! Yay! I get to drive! Now remember, go easy on the gas. Yippee! <gasps> the end. Dateline Desktop Observatory, where a plastic poindexter introduces the League to the joys of stargazing. There's Andromeda and the Crab Nebula. Hey, what are you guys looking at? The star's flesh. Goody! I want to see Sandra Bullock's! Bullock! Arg, I don't know why I even bother. What's this? Oh, no. I was afraid of this. What is it, Bill? Sandra Bullock's boyfriend? No, it's a meteor, and it's headed straight towards Earth. Action League, now. Today's episode, Armageddon out of here. As a menacing meteor heads towards Earth, our heroes devise a daring strategy. I wish I could help, but wouldn't you know it? Beep, beep. My ride's here. Me too. Me five. Well, tough toenail. You Nimrods are all we've got. Bill, give them the skinny. You'll be sent on a rocket to intercept the meteor and knock it off course with these really big bombs. Bombs? Cool. I'm in. Yeah. Ditto. Blast it. The world is counting on you people. Now get on it. 
And so, with extinction imminent, the League begins their crash course in astronaut training. This G-Force simulator will prepare you for the gravitational effects of takeoff. Yeah! I'm getting dizzy! Dixies! Make it stop! Mommy! At least the arugula is crisp. This pressure simulator will prepare you for the extreme conditions of deep space. It looks like a sledgehammer! Ow! It's a simulation of a sledgehammer. This launch simulator will... Let's just get it over with! Wow! Are we saving the world yet? Not yet, Flesh. But soon, for moments later at Cape Crabgrass, Three, two, one, blast off. We have ignition. The future of mankind is in their hands. We're all gonna die, aren't we, Bill? Yes. The engine's on the rocket. Go, vroom, 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 vroom. The engine's on the rocket. Go, vroom, vroom, vroom. Look, it's the meteor. This is mission control. Prepare to arm and deploy bombs. Bombs? Oopsie! I knew we forgot something. You idiot! I asked you if you had everything! We thought you meant our toothbrushes. Oh well, guess we'll head back home now. In a pig's eye! You ninnies are gonna crash that spaceship into the meteor! And that's an order! Oops! <coughs> Transmission problems! <coughs> Can't hear you, Chief! I like the people of Earth as much as the next bloke, but get real! We're out of here! Yay! Uh-oh. Is this the end of the Action League? Wait a minute. Who cares about those bozos? I don't want to die. <clears throat> Stay tuned for the Action Annihilated conclusion of Action League Now. Welcome back to the Henry and Tree. Action League Now. A planet doomed. A rocket kaboom. As a deadly showdown approaches, our ill-fated four reflect on the meaning of their lives. I never got to direct. I may have only been a chunk of melted plastic, but I tried. You blokes aren't such tossers after all. Gallers, I'm naked. Are we in heaven? No! We're on the meteor! We knocked it off course and saved the Earth! They're gonna give us the biggest parade when we get back. Back? To where? Uh -oh. Don't worry, Chief. According to my calculations, the meteor will return to the Earth's orbit in another 100,000 years. Do I look worried? The end. Dateline, the living room repository of knowledge, where the priceless records of human thought are pilfered by the evil genius, Smarty Pants. As soon as I steal the rest of the books and CDs, all the world's knowledge will be mine. Is that genius or what? With Smarty Pants on a swiping spree, the Action League safeguards the world's knowledge by putting it in the last place anyone would think to look. The flesh's brain. Gooders! A party hat! Is it my birthday again? Well, lab guy, did you kill him? Flesh, can you hear me? As surely as Madison is the capital of Wisconsin. Chess, anyone? Action League, now. Today's episode, A Flesh of Brilliance. We find our heroes harnessing the Flesh's new brain power. He did it! Amazing! If I hadn't seen it, I wouldn't have believed it. What's going on? I have successfully programmed the VCR. Yay! To record nothing but the History Channel. Ooh! All right, cut the chatter, you clowns. Smarty Pants is out there, and we gotta stop him. Excuse me, Chief. But there's no such word in the English language as gata. Ah, uh, right. Flesh, you stay here. We can't put your knowledge at risk. 
I'm a step ahead of you, Chief. To stay in touch, I fashioned these devices from a kit I ordered via the internet. Uh, whatever! Let's move out! Tut tut, Chief. Never end a sentence with a preposition. Blast it! Let's go! All those who like flesh better when he was an idiot, say I! I! Later, at Dad's Study National Archives. Okay, people. I want you quieter than a mute mouse at a monastery. You two stay here. Me and Stinky will... Excuse me, Chief. What is it now, Flesh? Stinky and I. Blast it! This is a grammar school! And I don't have to take any more... What have we here? Overnight egghead! Get me? Or do I have to come back there and spell it out for you? Later in Smarty Pants Hideout... What are we doing here? I'll state it simply so your tiny brains can comprehend. You're about to be destroyed, obliterated, pulverized, expunged. Who I've got a good vocabulary. The joke's on you, smarty pants. We've hidden the world's knowledge in a place you'll never find it. Bonjour, mes amis. Make that adios, amigo. My word. Flash, I told you to stay at headquarters! Pish posh! What good is having all the world's knowledge if there's no one to whom I can show it off? This nattering nabob is your so-called repository of knowledge? Quick, name the capital of Ohio. Columbus, of course. Correct! I obviously underestimated you. Perhaps a game of chess will prove my superior intellect. You strike me as a sporting man. May I propose a wager? If I win, you set us all free. And if I win, all the knowledge is mine. You're on, Mr. Uh... Doctor. Doctor the Flesh. One hour later... Your king appears to be in grave danger, Monsieur Pantalon. You play very well, Doctor Flesh. But it's not over until the heavyset woman warbles. It's your move. <laughs> Gullers! Where am I? Blimey! The blow to the head knocked all the knowledge out of his brain! Oh, no! Oh, yes. Lookers, I'm king of the castle. Ooh. Is this checkmate for the league? Or can a witless wonder match wits with a wicked wunderkin? Find out in the Action Brain's conclusion of Action League Now. Action League Now. The best build, the best brain. Is it too good to be true? You bet your gray matter. Time is running out, Dr. Flesh. Move or your colleagues perish. Ho, oh, ho! Oh, look at the horsey! I want to ride the horsey! Checkmate! It's inconceivable. I, smarty pants, have been defeated by an imbecile, simpleton, ignorabus, dollard! <laughs> Hooray! You're safe! Way to go, Fleshy! Hello. Later. I can't go to prison. I'm too smart for prison. Erudite, learned, scholarly. Good to have the old flesh back, huh? I'll say. I like you, horsey. Ooh. Ah! On second thought. The end. Dateline, first aid kit general hospital, where the chief is discharged after a debilitating injury. All ready to go home, Chiefy? No thanks to any of you! Hey, you think you got hurt? You should see the wood chipper. Can it, Meltman? If I keep working with you clowns, I'm gonna end up with a toe tag! Oh, come on, Chief. We made one blooming mistake. It'll never happen again. All ready, Freddy. Let's go! Wait! I wanna go inside the car! Inside! There's no room for your wheelchair. You'll be fine, Chief. No, you blockheads! <laughs> Well, at least we're near the hospital. Action League, now. Today's episode, Grief for the Chief. We find our heroes worriedly awaiting word of their squashed supervisor. Doc? Doc? Goose! I hope you're happy. The Chief's about to bite it. All we can do now is wait.
Poor guy. He's the best cheapy weepy I ever had. I loved him like a distant cousin. He's always been there for us. Like the time I was so afraid of ceiling fans, I couldn't fly. Come on, Thunder Girl. You can do it. No, I don't want to get chopped up again. You got to fly. Remember, a quitter never wins, and a winner never quits. You're right, Chief. I'm flying! Thunder Girl, flying like thunder. Thanks to the Chiefy, the best Chief around. Ow, 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 ow! I'm okay! That's a beautiful memory, Thunder Girl. Remember how the Chief saved our lives, Stinky? Do I ever! It was our darkest hour. Saturday night and no dates! Chief, it was right cricket of you to invite us to the fights. Yeah, you're more than a chief. You're a pal. Don't mention it. Remember, a friend in need is a friend indeed. The least we can do is buy you a bag of peanuts. Oh, no, that's okay. Gotta watch the sodium. I insist. One bag of peanuts right here, mate. Here you go, Frogman. <laughs> Those were special times. I have a special chief memory, too. He helped me find myself. Well, sure. He's done that for all of us. No, I mean, really. Where am I? Help! Where am I? Flesh, you're right here. Remember, you can't see where you're going with a can on your head. Oh, hooray! I'm here! Yippee! <laughs> <laughs> Was that justice? You have a story about the chief, too? I love that son of a biscuit. He's got to pull through. The chief's taken a turn for the worse. I'm afraid it's only a matter of time now. Can it be? Is the League about to lose its beloved leader? Stay tuned for the action-weeping conclusion of Action League Now. Action League Now. The Chief sliced, diced, bashed, and smashed. As the big guy prepares to meet the bigger guy, the League gathers around to say their final farewells. Chief, I know you can't hear me, but I want you to know we've been thinking about you. Yeah, like the time we blew you up with a nuclear bomb. And the time we accidentally diced you in a food processor. <laughs> I don't believe this. His blood pressure is suddenly skyrocketing. The time with the milkshake maker. The trash compactor. The waffle iron. Ah! Blimey, the chief's come out of his deadly coma. Hooray! That's our chiefy! He's back! Gotta love him! Yeah! And you morons are in more trouble than a ballerina in a barroom brawl! Come on, chief. We're going home. No! Don't touch me! No! Oopsies! The end. Today's episode, I've been working on Derail Road. Hey, you guys, look. I found my original nose. Hey, Thunder Girl, after I get it reattached, how about going for a ride in my new sports car? I'd love to. Wait, you mean with you? I'm sorry, I'm busy. Listen up, everybody. There are too many trains crashing on the B.O. line. You guys are going undercover to get to the bottom of it. Any questions? Just one. Is plastic surgery covered by our health plan?
Check it out, Thunder Girl. I haven't been able to whistle since the accident. But unbeknownst to our heroes, a master criminal lurks just around the bend. None other than his dishonor, the mayor. Doing some undercover work, action losers. Very clever. Oh, look, there's the flesh in that human potty, stinky diver. Come on, sing with me. It's a railroad tradition. It's back breaking work and the pay is low. Sweat. In the way on the old beach. Ow! You idiot! You crushed my toe! Earning my pay on the old B.O. Hey! Good one, Stinky! Those fools! Don't they know that nothing must interfere with my evil plan? Whee! Faster, faster! I love the wind in my hair! No, no, you don't understand. I dropped my nose. Nah! That's Milkman. He's in trouble. Come on. Hate to send you out of your way. Injection molded ninnies. Ah! And now it's your turn, Tuna Melt and Dunder Girl. Milkman, look. Let's get out of here. Not without my nose! Ooh, this is going to be good. Milkman! Oh, if only I had Kung Fu Grip! No! Oh, here's trouble. Why'd you do it, Mayor? For the insurance money, so I could throw myself a really big birthday party. Goody, I love parties. You're not invited. Meltman's nose, it's all that's left of him. And I never got a chance to. Never got a chance to what, Thunder Girl? Get back that ten bucks you owe me. Oh. The end. Dateline, Arctic Park. Where we find Stinky Diver communing with nature. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Gotcha, sucker! Ah, help me! Lunch later, action now! Help me, I'm drowning! Hold on, right. You, you're smelling. No, I'm stinky! Stinky diver! The lake! It's hardening! Like some sort of demon polymer! Must stay afloat! Hey kid! Give me a hand! Hang on! I'll call the action lake! No! I need help! Get the fire department! The Coast Guard! Anybody can stand! Action League! Now! Today's episode... Stinky on Ice! You sure you want to arm wrestle again, Meltman? Come on, you big naked chicken. Best two out of three. Uh, three out of five? Meltman, the flesh. Action facts. Accident in Arctic Park. Stinky needs our help. Action League, away! I hate it when she does that. Hey, guys, wait for me. Stinky! Stinky! If only Thunder Girl could read minds, she might hear Stinky's cries for help. Something like, I'm running out of air! Get me out of here! What's with you? I'm c c c cold That's because you're naked, you plastic pituitary case. You're also turning blue. Maybe you should go warm up. I'll find him myself. I'll be right back! Ah! Hang in there, Stinky. By the oath of the Action League, I swear I'll find you wherever you are. Meanwhile... Come on, guys. I want to help. Two minutes in the hot tub and hello, ladies. Stinky! Stinky! I know. I'll follow my nose. 
Yuck, that smells like him. Oh, no! Could this be the end for our putrid protagonist? Will the Action League get there in time? Or will our tainted toilet swimmer turn into a stinksicle? Stay tuned for the action-choked conclusion of Action League Now! When we last left the Action League, Thunder Girl and Melt Man were out of commission. While the flesh chilled out in the hot tub. Who will save Stinky from his gelatinous grave? Flesh! You saved my life! Ah! Don't touch me! Stinky? I'm sorry I ever doubted you guys. The Action League is A-OK. -okay. Ow! I'm burnt! Wait till the gang hears how I tunneled my way out. Hey, that's a waste of energy. Good thing I'm here. Action League away! Dateline, creamed corn chemical plant. Where super fab pop star Johnny Cool is about to play a reluctant role in a gruesome grand finale. Help! Like, help, baby! And the maestro of this murderous maelstrom, none other than his dishonor, the mayor. Ha <laughs> ha! With super fat pop star Johnny Cool out of the way, the world will buy my records! I'll be rich! Action League, to the rescue! B-I-N-G-O, 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 and Bingo was his name. Oh, oh no, it's super fat pop star Johnny Cool. And he's suspended over a deadly cauldron of cream corn. Mmm, yummy. Curses, action imbeciles, just when it was getting good. Somebody, like, do something. Hang on, Johnny. Guys, I need a rescue line up here and another pair of hands on the double. Going up! Oh. Got it! Man, we're good. Okay, Meltman, out you go! Have no fear, Meltman is here. What am I, nuts? I'm not going out there. It's way too scary. Meltman, hurry up! It's about to snap! Yeah, like hurry! I'll be there in a jiff. Got to think of a way out of this. But what? What? Like, oh! Problem solved. Action League now presents In the Wine of Fire. We find our heroes at Action Headquarters, where the Chief handles Meltman's meltdown with delicate diplomacy. You're fired! Why? Because you're as yellow as a jar of mustard at a jaundice convention! But I like it here. Come on, Chief. Give him a break. Cut him some slacks. Well, all right. But this is your last chance! I'm giving you a job so easy, even you can't mess it up! Have you ever heard of super fab pop star Blandy? Sure. For some reason, this paranoid prima donna thinks she needs a bodyguard. Think you can handle it? I'm all over it, Chief. He thinks I'm a Frady cat? I'll show that blowhard jerk. I heard that! Uh, melt man away! I don't know about you, mates, but I'm a little worried. Me too. I'll just die if anything happens to Blandy. Listen up, people! Try and focus here! Johnny Cool is the 19th performer in the top 20 to bite the dust. What I want to know is, who's next? Know the lab guy? Analysis. There's nothing I can do. We've got to figure out where this madman will strike next. I'll never find a love. I wonder if this is the place. I'll never find the one. Oh, hello. The recycling is out back. Uh, no. I'm Meltman, your new bodyguard. I'm here to protect you. Oh, what does it matter? 
You can have all the protection in the world, but without love, you're caught in the crosshairs of loneliness. I'll never find a love. I'll never find. <gasps> Get a robot! What the? Ah! Help! Don't worry, Blandy. That thing is toast. Don't be an idiot. Run! Save yourself! <laughs> With Blandy out of the way, I'll be top of the pops. Cooler than Coolio! Come on, mates. Let's kick some robot romp! <laughs> hey, Tin Man! This ought to put some hair on your chest! Thunder Girl, wrapping a robot, covering for Mouth Man, who's a really big wuss. Knock, knock. Anybody home? We've got him on the ropes. Dread, evil is interrupt us. Next time, no more Mr. Nice Mayor. Say, I wonder what this is. Is, but I could play with it all day. Whee! Let me go, you galvanized goon! Ah! Uh oh! Whoa! Boo! Just when you start having fun, you run out of batteries. Is it safe yet? That was a close one. Hey, anybody got any batteries? Oh, he hello, Melty. Flesh, what are you doing here? And what's with that killer robot controller? Say, what is this? Uh, nothing. We're just, uh, going... Bowling! See ya! Wait a second. You think I don't know what's going on here? You guys set this up to make me look good for the chief, didn't you? No! You got it all wrong! Honest! Well, you can go back and tell him that I'm nothing but a big chicken loser. Now go on, get out of here. That went well. I guess it's time to face the music. Meat Man, you saved me! I, uh... You're a hero! I don't think you understand. Oh, hush your sweet melted face and listen to what I have to say. At last I found a love. At last I found the one. My heart's been fasting a neck. It's been casting for that everlasting true love. Great. Now how am I going to tell her? Meanwhile, at an abandoned warehouse... <laughs> when Blandy goes on stage tonight, I'll be calling the tune. What's this? Could it be the final curtain for a super fab songstress? Or will a melted mama's boy finally find his spine? Stay tuned for the action denting conclusion of Action League Now. Action League Now. Meltman, Big Chicken, Blandy, Love Stricken. As his dishonor directs an automated assassin, an adoring audience awaits a siren song. Ladies and gentlemen, Please put your hands together for the first lady of forewarned, super fab box star, Blandy. Tell her I'm a chicken, but I'm too darn chicken. Talk about irony. Woof. 
thank you. You're beautiful. You've touched the very soul of my soul. Just like somebody else here tonight. I can't keep living this lie. I've got to do something. In fact, he's watching over me right now, like my own little guardian angel. Melty, just go out there and tell her the truth. And I'm hoping that he'll come out here and join me. Blandy! Yes! There he is! Meat Man, everyone! Come on out here, sweetheart, and sing with me! What? No! You don't understand! Hey, look, it's Melty! He's a super fat pop star! action jerks ever give up? Hey, Blandy! I've got a smash hit just for you! Get it? I was smashing and hitting things! <laughs> okay, you guys, enough is enough. It's no use trying to make me look good. What's that fool on about? Ow! Ah! Oh. You buttinskis are really starting to get on my nerves! Why can't they... Just mind their own business. I'll show them. Help! Meat Man, save me! <laughs> hey, gang! Heads up! Take that, you meddling morons! Ah! Oh! Hooray for Melty! Bravo, mate! Yeah! Way to go, Melty! Will you guys just cut it out? It's true, Meltman! Not only did you save Blandy's life, but you solved the crime! Look! The mayor was behind it the whole time! He was? Curses! Still an unsung zero! Hey, so that means... I'm a hero! Meat Man! Sweet Meat Man! You've saved my life yet again! With you by my side, we'll tour the world living only on love! Blandy, the only tour I can take right now is a tour of duty with the Action League! But I'll never forget you, for you helped me find the courage I always knew I had! Close one. You were saying, Melty? Um, never mind. Hey, who wants to go bowling? Yes, Me? please. I'm Let's... in buggy. The end. <laughs> That's all the action for today, action fans. Join us again next time for more adventures with the Action League. They're plastic. They're spastic. They're fantastic.